Hello, welcome back. Welcome to day three of Wonderland Week. Thank you for joining me. As you can tell, I am super excited about the prospect of Wonderland Week. I am a big kid. I know I'm sad, but I don't really care. So, today I've got a mini file folder to share with you and a couple of little envelopes. I want to put this to one side because that's what I'm most proud of and I'd like you to stay tuned. And I'm going to show you these two first. So, these are digital papers that I printed off from Etsy. So I've used some different washi tapes on these and I've used some silver thickers to spell out Open Me and Charms. So let's have a look at the charms first. Now in yesterday's video I showed you those one inch circle die cuts that I created from a downloadable file. I've also used the same images to create some little bottle cap charms. So I already had these bottle cap charms and they came with the epoxy epoxy stickers so what I've done is I've just popped these little images inside the bottle cap charm and stuck the epoxy sticker over the top so I've got the white rabbit the mad hatter Alice drinking from her bottle Tweedledee and Tweedledum Tweedledum Tweedledee whichever way around and then another picture of the mad hatter then we've got the queen of hearts got Alice and the Flamingo and the March Hare so I haven't used all of the images because I've just used this many bottle caps but I thought they've come out really really beautiful and as I say I've kept given her a load of the die cuts already but these just make them a little bit more special to use as embellishments and I'm not, I'm not bothered if Sam keeps these to use for herself or whether she gifts them to other people as well that's up to her to do with but I really enjoyed making them and then in this one that says open me there are some tags so again these were a downloadable file so then you've got the caterpillar some of these there's two of and some of them there's only one and I'll show you why in a second you've got the queen of hearts then you've got the walrus and the old man and all the little oysters you've got the mad hatter the white rabbit love this one and I love the colours of these and then you've got the March Hare and the Dormouse and the Mad Hatter. You've got that one again. And then I think this is where they all duplicate or some of them duplicate. There's also this one with Alice drinking, the Cheshire Cat, and then the Mad Hatter, that one, and the White Rabbit again. And what I love about these is I don't really own inks or distress inks or any blending tools or anything like that. So I can't create effects like this. I mean, I'd love to own different ink pads, but I, I haven't got any at the moment. So for things like this, I, I could not create this. And these have just, they're just printed on white cardstock. And they are stunning, aren't they? Absolutely, absolutely beautiful. So I've included her some of these. And now onto this. This is a mini file folder. So I've taken the inspiration from a lady called Danny, who is Pop Fizz Paper on YouTube. I've discovered her channel very recently, and I have honestly been binge watching her videos because she is incredible. She's in America, but she just has some of the best tutorial happy mails, happy mail ideas, sorry, all sorts of bits and pieces. And I've just really loved watching her channel. So this is a mini file folder that I've created based on one of her tutorials, which I will link down below. So I've used black cardstock to create the folder itself. Then I've backed the front and back using, there's some silver glitter paper, but then on top of that is some of the downloadable paper that I've printed a load of. Then this is a card that I printed off. This was free on the internet. So I can't go back to yesterday because I was a different person then. Then I've used some of the one inch circle pictures I've popped them up on foam tape to give them some dimension and there were two gemstones but there appear to only be one left so I need to replace the one from this corner then you can see there's a little cat paper clip that one is from tiger no typo sorry I'm going to slide that off and then just on the back sorry you've got a picture of the Mad Hat and the March Hare and Alice all having tea and I've used some little paper mania stars in the top and bottom corners just to give it a little bit of interest i absolutely love this image and i had to include it somewhere and as you can see there's a couple of paper clips on the top which i'll show you as i open it so this is what the file folder looks like inside so you create it in a way so that you've got these two pockets at the bottom and then it just opens like a little book and i absolutely loved it so 
I'm going to take out the bits and pieces so you can see what it looks like plain and then we'll pop them back in together. So there's the cupcake um, paper clip up the top here. That's one that I made in one of my recent videos with my little A for Amy there. Then there's this little blue pom-pom paper clip, again one that I made recently. And that's just holding the, this blue bling onto the file folder. Then there are some more of those little one inch circle pictures because I just, I absolutely love these and I'm hoping that she can make use of them. And then on this side, there's a little baggie of, sorry, it's a bag, it's because I've been watching all Danny's videos, that's what she calls them, of different images. So a lot of these are in the pocket letter and these are some of the other ones. So how long is forever? Sometimes just one second, love that. And you've got imagination is the only weapon in the war against reality. How do you know I'm mad, said Alice. You must be, said the cat, or you wouldn't have come here. And you've got the same one from the front. The chief difficulty Alice found at first was in managing her flamingo. The Mad Hatter, you're not the same as you were before. You were much, much more muchier. You've lost your muchness. Then the white rabbit, and then the back one is Alice watching the rabbit run away as she gets bigger. So I just loved some of those quotes. So I've included those in this little clear bag. And then my favourite little one was this one. She generally gave herself very good advice, though she's very seldom followed it. So I attached that one with a little cat paper clip there. Another one of the ones from Typo. That's the little card. And then I've created these two tags using some blue ribbon from Hobbycraft and some, what do they call this? The sequin trim. It's like iridescent sequin trim. It's very pink in the light today and I've just stapled those on rather than looping them through the hole which is another idea I got from Danny pop fizz paper rather than using the loop itself she just staples them on and it just has a really nice effect and I've used these two tags to do that so this is what the file folder looks like on its own so I've used I've layered some washi in the top and bottom corners again that was complete inspiration from her tutorial but you know me gotta have some bling so I've added some little bling trim in between the washies. Also, I didn't have a skinny washi that went with these two. Then I've got some little Paper Mania stars in the top and bottom corners because they just looked too plain without. You know me, bling, bling, bling. And then some more of these little one-inch pictures up on um, foam tape. And then there was one other little cat paper clip which I had to include there. So as I say, there was these little one-inch pictures just went on this side. Then this bling went on here. The tape was there to sort of stick it, but it didn't work very well. So I've been using the paper clip to hold it up there. The little cupcake paper clip was just as a little decoration. Then this card was in, and the reason I paper clipped this instead of sticking this on is that Sam can take this off and use it if she'd like to. Then we had the two tags in this side. And then the little quote pictures there as well. And then when you closed it, you just pop the little cat on there and it kept it closed. And I absolutely love this. I'm definitely going to be making more little file folders. And they're so cute, look. It's like the size of my hand. It's really little. It's just adorable. If you'd like to know how to make these, I will link to Danny's channel. But I'm happy to make some of these on camera if you would be interested. Just obviously leave a comment below and let me know. Hope you're enjoying this What Alice in Wonderland series as much as I am. Although I don't know if you can enjoy it as much as me. I'm genuinely stoked and I keep saying that I'm sorry I'm, j I'm just excited and please tune in tomorrow for day four please give me a like if you've been enjoying these videos and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you all again soon take care bye